this is a young female, aged uh, 18 years, referred for the evaluation of uh, low grade constant uh, abdominal pain for the last six months. And uh, here we see is uh, this is the urinary bladder, and this is the fluid. Ascytic fluid, this is the uterus seen through the ascytic fluid and these are the bubble segments floating in this uh, ascytic fluid. And there are septas, there is debris over there. This is the septa and this is the dependent region debris seen within it. These are the bowel segments, the ascites and uh, the urinary bladder in longitudinal section. You can see the septum, this one. And uh, you can see the debris. This is the debris. And in the debris you will see incomplete thin septals. This is incomplete thin septa. This is rather a complete septa. Here you see it's a complete thin septa floating, uh, flapping within uh, the aesthetic fluid. So, in transfer section, you are seeing again uh, the fluid. This is the uterus in transfer section and this is the ovary in transfer section. This is the ovary with a tiny small follicle, developing follicle. This is the transfer section and this is the fluid. And you can see a dancing septum. This is the septum, incomplete thin septum. You will see every in this dependent region. This is every. So this is a case of uh, abdominal pox, uh, until unless proven otherwise, because all the other parameters are normal, and there is only ascites. Now this is fluid seen in the para left paracolic gutter. This is the fluid. These are the bowel segments. Why in the paracolic gutter? Because here you see the muscle, the iliosaurus muscle, and it's anterior to it, and uh, bubbles are floating in it. Similarly, if you go towards the right side, yes, again, now see, this is the fluid again in the, the right paracolic gutter. This is the fluid in the right paracolic gutter. And, uh, This is the ideal source muscle. This is the fluid, these are the bowel segments floating in it. Okay. The kidney is okay, normal. Liver is okay, gallbladder is fine. There are no paraortic planets. In the this is the aorta. This is the superior mesentery part arising from it, the celiac axis. And then now tracing the aorta. We do not find any arising nodes around the pores of the iliac vessels as well. So this is uh, a case of abdominal fog. So further studies will be required. The spleen is not alive. The kidney is fine. So this is a case study regarding uh, abdominal fog. Thank you very much.